How is it going everybody? You're watching Then About Tag and today I'm going to unbox the Apple AirTag and also its most important accessory, the AirTag Loop. And of course, I'll also give you my first impressions. So let's talk about that unboxing experience, which I know it's pretty cool. And also, let me tell you what I think about those products. Let's, let's talk about build quality. Uh, let me show you also how's the setup process, if it's easy or not, and obviously give you a little bit of a demo on how the AirTag actually work. All right, so without further ado, let's begin. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna unbox is of course the accessory, so the AirTag loop. I chose this orange color just because I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, and as you guys can see here, there's a little demonstration on the back showing us how to actually use it. So you'll pop up the AirTag in it, uh, button it, and then put it through, and then you can use it as a loop. As you guys can see here, there's a little luggage or a suitcase or something like that. And that's pretty much it, all right? On the sides, there is nothing, pretty much nothing important on the back. That's it. Uh, so now let's open it up. And Apple has been using this very cool little seal for a while now. So all you have to do is do this. And then it's very satisfying. And then uh, you're just going to put your finger right here, put it down, and then slide it out. Let's slide it like that. My bad. So let's slide it like that. Let's put the accessory on the side. And then, of course, let's see what's, what else is in the box. And then, yeah, nothing. Just this little piece of paper right here, which honestly <laughs> makes kind of makes no sense. So here we have the accessory itself. And as you guys can see, uh, this loop that I got is rubber. So it's not leather or anything like that. It's very rubber, like silicon feel to it. And you just pull it out. Very satisfying as well. And then we have nothing else here. Put it to the side. And here is the accessory. It's very, very thin. The Apple loop is extremely thin, as you can see. It doesn't feel extremely high quality, actually it feels pretty bad quality if you ask me. And of course, here's where we put the air tag. So now let's put that to the side and let's begin with the air tag unboxing itself, which is the most important part, right? So air tag in the front, image of the device on the front. This is the back bottom part. We'll have a look at that. Um, right here in the back, just regular information, nothing that's really interesting. Nothing on this side, nothing on this side, nothing interesting really here. So just like the other one, let's just rip, rip the seal. Oh, I missed it. Ah, it's pretty cool as well. So uh, put it as well the same way. So we're going to pull it out and out. And then now we'll just pull this little tab. And as you can see, air tag. Let's put it right here, just to see if there's anything else which is important in the box, which I doubt, nothing else. And this is just documentation, 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 nothing important, really. And then we have the device, the star of the show, which is the AirTag. And then here we have some information uh, saying that it is a Bluetooth tracker, of course. And then if we open it up as well, we have air tag in the middle and then we also have here the information that we're going to use find my iphone to use it and that it needs to be relatively close uh, to start pairing and a lot of that so let's pull out the device and we don't need this anymore it's all blank and then here is the air tag as you guys can see so we have this little plastic wrap let's just undo it as you guys can see here, very shiny, very beautiful, good looking back, which is very scratchable. And then if we undo the other part, we have the front, which is plastic. As you guys can see, very glossy plastic. And all you have to do to activate it, to turn it on, is just pull out this tab. And then we have a little note, which is very, very low in volume. I thought it was pretty loud, but it's not. So. I just hope you guys could hear that, that, that sound. That means that this is on, this is activated. Now, let's set it up and see what's the deal. 
All right, so the first thing I wanna show you is the setup process. And all you have to do is bring your iPhone close to the AirTag. And as you guys can see, it just takes like two seconds for it to recognize it. So it's gotta be pretty close for this first setup. So around two inches, like five centimeters more or less, and then it'll instantly pick up, all right? After that, you can start setting it up. So let me show you. So you can go ahead here. I have a lot of light in the studio. So you can tap on connect, as you guys can see, and then you're gonna name your AirTag. So you're gonna pretty much name the object that your AirTag will track, will be close to. That's pretty much it. So like a backpack, a bike, a camera, handbag, headphones, jacket, luggage, umbrella, custom name, wallet, anything that you want, right? I'm gonna put backpack because I think I'm gonna use this with my backpack, right? Now we're gonna register the AirTag to your Apple ID. So as you guys can see, there's my picture, my email and my phone number, which of course I'll blur. <laughs> and then I can tap on continue. And then as you guys can see, it's setting up Daniel's backpack. So now it's just a matter of waiting a few seconds. I don't think this will take too long. And as you guys can see in here, there was a little beep, a little chime just letting you know that it's connected. And of course, it's now with you because it's close to my iPhone. Uh, we have precision finding. So when AirTag is nearby, an arrow will point to its precise location. I'm gonna show you this in a second. There's a possibility of playing a sound. So if your AirTag is a little bit hidden, you can just tap on it and it'll play a sound and then you can hear it. And then we have directions in maps. So if it's really far away, we can use maps to navigate, which is awesome. Now you can tap view in find my app. Let's tap here and let's actually go to find my, which is the application which we'll use to actually manage the air tag, All right? So tap on continue. And then as you guys can see here, we have my backpack, which is like this red backpack and it's just showing us the exact location of this air tag therefore of my backpack which is not in right now which but it will be right so then daniel's backpack it's telling me that it's with you because it's very close to my iphone battery is full and then that's pretty much it we can tap to play a sound we can find and we can see your not notifications so let's first play a sound let's have a listen And of course we can tap to stop. Again, I'm not gonna show everything about this in this video because otherwise this would be a full review. And my idea here is just to give you my first impressions. Now, let's put this guy inside this other guy, which should be pretty easy by just lifting this. There's a little button, which is very satisfying actually. Now you can slide in and then button again. Cool. And now I can do this and I can use it as a loop. So then I can put around any object. That's pretty much how it works. If you wanna put inside, not really inside, but if you wanna put this close, if you wanna use your air tag to track something that ha doesn't have a pocket or anything, like for example, your headphones or your bike or your umbrella, you'll need to use an accessory like that because otherwise there's no way you can fit this inside an object which doesn't have any pockets or anything, all right? And now, last but not least, let me show you the precision finding and let me show you how this really works, this indoor navigation towards your device. Let me show you. So as you can see, that's pretty much all your AirTag can do. There are a few other things that I can do, a few other features, but as I said, I have a dedicated video on the AirTag on everything it can do, a really in-depth review, and you guys can have a look right here and in the description down below. That's pretty much it. I'm not gonna give you my verdict yet on if you should or shouldn't buy, because again, this is only my first impressions, all right? So that's pretty much it. And I'll see you in a few days. Bye-bye.